uh, as you know us germany and uk continue to be the large investors in india over two decades now uh, and also india is a big market for the large companies uh, like also for the small companies how do you see really this 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 relationship developing now well, what I see in the trade relationship between India and the United States is verified by your own business today. The U.S. has surpassed China to become India's top trading partner, showing greater economic ties between the two countries. The main difference is with India, the U.S. is dealing with the largest democracy in the world. The government needs the will to make structural changes to its business laws, regulations, tariffs, bureaucracy, and red tape not to mention the political whims of parties, which also breeds corruption. We know India has the talent, and the brain power, well-educated with good worth ethic, good business mind, great leadership qualities, and many other desirable qualities. All they need is for the government to get out of the way and unleash their potential. Now is the time for India to seize the opportunity this is unexpected crisis has provided. For India, the time is now, and I believe the future economic relationship with the, between the U.S. and India will become one of the greatest partnerships in the world. I don't believe that we will return to business and life as usual before COVID-19. The new normal applies not only to our business life, but our life in general as a whole. I have a renewed hope in the final outcome of surviving this pandemic experience but caution and remind everyone that there will be a new normal and how India adapts to it will guarantee India's place as a leading world economic powerhouse, which is in the end, will benefit its citizens toward an incredible future.